4 things I wish I knew in my early 20s. After watching this video, you will learn how you can edit shorts like Ali Abdal and Filmora 13. Like this. 4 things I wish I knew in my early 20s happiness edition. Let's get started. First, open Filmora 13 and drag your video from the media library onto the timeline. Next, go to display settings to adjust your project settings. I usually change the aspect ratio to 916 portrait for my videos. Now, to resize your video to fit the project, double click on it. Use the transform tool to adjust the scale values. To animate it like Ali Abdal, add two transform keyframes at the beginning of your video. Adjust the scale and position in the second keyframe to achieve a smooth effect. To further refine the animation, select the keyframes in the panel and curve them. If you have a PNG image in your media, drag and drop it onto the timeline. You can find the download link for this PNG in the description. Scale and position the image accordingly. Add two keyframes for the image where the video keyframes are located. Reset the image in the first keyframe. Then move its position upwards. Next, duplicate the video and place it in the top track. Use the AI Portrait tool to remove the background from the duplicate. Create two empty video tracks below the duplicate. Add quick text to these tracks. Double click the text to adjust its size position and edit its content in the basic section. For the text I'm using the traveling typewriter font, which you can download for free from the description. You can customize the text color to match Ali Abdal's style. If you need multiple instances of the same text, duplicate it and make your edits. For both texts, supply animations like typewriter appears for the in animation effect. You can also add out animations as needed. Compound clip both texts to easily adjust their size and position together. To edit text timing, select the compound clip instead of the main timeline. 
For instance, if I want to shorten this text, I'll split and delete the extra part of the compound clip. Ali Abdal uses similar text editing techniques in his short videos. For example, I'll drag and drop this picture from the stock media. Scale and position the image accordingly. To achieve paper transitions like Ali Abdal, navigate to the Transitions tab and search for Paper. You'll find various paper transitions to choose from, download your preferred transition. Next you'll need an adjustment layer for the transition. Drag and drop an adjustment layer from the media, set its duration and position. Then place your chosen paper transition onto the adjustment layer from the transitions tab. Now, let's add quick text again. Adjust its duration, double click to edit the text. Adjust its size, position and edit its content in the basic section. And add extra spaces between words if needed. I'm using the traveling typewriter font for consistency. If you need multiple instances of the same text, duplicate and edit them in the same manner. Adjust the player zoom to your liking in the display settings. Ali Abdel often applies highlighter effects beneath such text. To achieve this, create an empty track below the text. Go to stock media and drag a colored image of your choice onto this track. I've chosen a black image. Double click the image. Go to the mask section and use the drawing tool to create a mask around the text like this. Now, select everything on the timeline with CTRLA. While holding CTRL, click on the black image. Press E to disable everything except the black image on the timeline. Take a snapshot of this black image in PNG format. Delete the black image from the timeline and replace it with the snapshot at the same position in the media. Select everything on the timeline again and enable it. Double click on this snapshot. In the mask section, choose a linear mask, invert it and animate the black image with this linear mask as shown. This mask should only apply position animation. Repeat this process to create highlighter effects for the remaining texts. Follow these steps to achieve a highlighter effect similar to mine. You know I don't play right Just give me the word I Uh-huh, uh-huh You know I don't play right Don't give me this I'm gonna get back when I feel like You know I don't play right I'll put up a good fight Just give me the word I Uh-huh, uh-huh Once done, we'll apply text animations to the last two texts for both texts, I'll apply the typewriter appears animation.
Adjust the animation duration to match the highlighter effect. Now finally we learn to make this animation like Ali Abdal. I'll split the same video here, and move it to the top track. At the beginning of this video segment I'll add two transform keyframes. In the first keyframe adjust the size and position like this. Then make it disappear from the screen. Always adjust the gap between keyframes to control the animation duration. This creates an animation like this. And there you have it. We've edited our shorts in the style of Ali Abdel.